Well, let's get into the groove with the one and only Rithik Roshan. So, Rithik, are you a slave to time or are you perpetually racing against time? Well, time is what makes up life. So, I don't think there is anything more important than time. Um, and I think time has got a lot to do with uh, success and the interpretation of success. So, according to me, if you have if you have time, if you have made time or, you know, created time to do all the things that you wish to do or want to do in your life, then you truly are successful. This is something that I have been saying and uh, trying to practice myself in my life. And uh, yeah, it's, it's uh, difficult, but I have to tell you that it's very, very possible to, to have, make time for every single thing that you want to do. So are you having the time of your life? <laughs> well... There's always time for Rado, because I love the brand. And I think you know that my love for Rado is, uh, is not hidden. I am one of the lucky uh, few who gets to endorse a brand that they truly love. So uh, yes, of course, always time for Rado. Um, the things that I would like to make time for, well, I would like to make time for things that I love to do, which is uh, what I love. I love uh, fitness, so I definitely make time for my, uh, my fitness routines, exercise. I make time for my family, my kids, because I truly love and enjoy, be, enjoy being with them. Uh, I love traveling, I love adventure, I love, uh, so I make time for a variety of things. And I, I think, I think uh, a diverse life is a successful life at least for me. The way I see and uh, wish to lead my life is, is uh, doing a variety of things and not just, not just uh, you know, trying to uh, cash out on, on that, that one thing that is making money. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so. Well, everybody keeps a watch on you, but if you were given an opportunity to design an app or a device that you would incorporate into the watch you are wearing, what would that be? Well, Pooja, to be honest, you know, I've never really been a watch enthusiast. But uh, I have to say, ever since I, uh, my association with Rado began, my, I've discovered this newfound, uh, you know, love and uh, uh, excitement uh, for watches and uh, being associated now for six years with, with Rado, uh, they, have, they have not uh, failed in, in impressing me with every single collection that they launch. Uh, I am truly, truly happy endorsing a brand that have, makes products that I truly love to wear. So my, my uh, aspirations or desires with watches are completely fulfilled. So do not, do, do not need to create a watch by myself. That's one thing I can leave to someone else. <laughs> we are all set to see you play Anand Kumar in Super 30. So how are the preps going? Are you brushing up your math? Or were you a good student in school when it came to math? Well, let's say I was, I was uh, above average in most of the subjects in school. Maths was, uh, maths was a, I wasn't great in maths but it, it definitely grabbed my curiosity and more so now because, you know, uh, every single thing that we see around us, whether it's, uh, you know, uh, theory or hypothesis or ideology or biology or physics or whatever, whatever human beings, even uh, statistics, uh, study of something, Every single thing requires maths. You know, there's maths in nature. There's maths in uh, in uh, the petals of of a, of a rose, a flower, a leaf. So maths really is something that that uh, has manifested all around us. So, Rithik, what was it that made you say yes to reliving the life and times of Anand Kumar on a screen? No, I I haven't said yes uh, to him or to a person. I have said yes to a wonderful and beautiful journey that I read one day in my house in the afternoon. And it completely, uh, you know, struck me and uh, made me laugh, made me cry, made me, made my hair, you know, uh, 
rise on its end. So it's something that, that uh, resonated with me very, very deep. And uh, something like that, when it comes along, you just, you just can't say no. You know, you, you just, you just, it becomes your life. <laughs> Rithik, your fans are rather happy with you. After doing one film in two years, now you've decided to do a film a year. So, Tiger Shroff often calls you his mentor and now the mentor and the protégé are all set to share screen space in YRF's next. So, what can we expect? Yeah, well, uh, my film with uh, uh, Tiger is, is up next after Super 30 and that is, I think, uh, something that will go down really well with uh, the my fans who have been waiting for you know uh, to, to to see me in the kind of roles that i've done in in doom or uh, bang bang and so it's 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 going to be uh, you know uh, something from that world very very exciting to go back to that i think that is something that i love and enjoy doing so i should do more of those uh, unfortunately i haven't uh, come across many intelligent scripts uh, you know where in in that particular zone but i have now so soon enough krishvo we are all waiting for that so how are the preps going on that front uh well my father's working very hard on krishvo so so am i uh but that's going to take its course take its time still a long way to go um but yeah very excited for that as well wish us luck fingers crossed <laughs> Well, Ritik Roshan, thank you so much for talking to us and keep entertaining us and all the very best for your future projects. Thank you, Pooja, to you as well and to all our friends out there. Good luck.